Welcome back for another FTT price prediction analysis video and at the time of this recording FTT continues to hold below the 20 day MA here on the 4 hour chart which is now acting as resistance for us to continue gearing up. We are also seeing a bit of a breakdown after this massive pump in a move that gave us a break above resistance at $5.5 giving us a high above the six dollars and you can see that after getting the high above the six dollars we have been seeing much of a pullback losing support at the 4.8 dollars and also support at four dollars and the next area of support that i'm watching on the ftt chart to continue holding now lies at three dollars and this is an area that ftt needs to continue holding for us to still expect higher prices and in case of a reversal from the prices that we are trading within we need to see a break above resistance at four dollars flipping it back into support and a break above that with a successful retest then we can easily see ftt get above the 4.8 dollars in the next coming hours once more ftt has also continued to obey the editor structures and zooming out on the charts to also give you my edit wave analysis by first giving you a recap of what has been happening you can see that last year after the FTX collapse we saw this massive breakdown in a move that took us to all time lows and after seeing the all time lows we had been stuck for a near within this range between the 0 0.95 dollars and the 1.56 dollars and finally this year we saw the breakout out of this range over here to the upper side in a move that gave us a break above that is a high above the 5.5 in a move that i'm terming as the formation of this additive count one and after seeing the formation of that first wave we saw a bit of a corrective move in the formation of this wave two into the minimum target areas highlighted on the charts using this red target area which is an area that we almost fully maximized and saw a bit of a reaction to the upside in a move that I was terming as the start of an impulsive wave in the formation of this wave 3 whose minimum target areas assuming that we have the low for the second wave can be given by connecting the trend based Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave 1 then dragging the Fibs to the low of the second wave giving me a minimum target area for the third wave at the fib level 1.618 and that is above the ten dollars and we can also use the fib ratios one is to one to get a target area above the 7.33 dollars and those are areas that i'm watching out for in case ftt is able to break above resistance flipping it back into support and continuing higher prices but in case we don't see such a movement in the next coming hours then expect a bit of a deeper pullback maybe at some point losing support at three dollars into this red target area that i have over here which lies between the 3.2 dollars and the 1.94 dollars and this is an area that ftt needs to continue holding in case we see that deeper pullback because if by any chance we break out of this red target area to the lower side because we can easily see a move back below the one dollar in case we break out of this red target area over here so those are the possible moves that we need to watch out for here on the ftt chart for the next coming hours and i hope that video was of much up to you and i hope to catch you in the next one